hey guys welcome to the video and in this video i am going to be showing you a step for step guide for salvaging with the vulture so of course the first thing that you are going to need is you are going to need a vulture of course that can be bought by the drake industries over at hurston so welcome i hope you enjoy this video and let's get started so once you enter your ship the first thing first that you want to do is you want to press 2 to open up the map want to go over to contracts going to go over to salvaging and you are going to choose a contract here i would not recommend doing the 50,000 because that is a little bit too big for the vulture but let's go take the anvil arrow which is a 5,000 fee we are going to acquire it and we are going to say we where we have to go so it's going to be her l1 once you have selected the contract make your way outside of the hangar okay. so once you are in the air what you want to do is you want to see where the location is that you need to go okay for me it's going to be a little bit far because i am currently on microtech but i want to go i need to go to i think it is Earl l1 so what you want to do is you want to click on it choose the route it's going to put your route automatic there and you are going to make sure you are in your navigation mode so by holding down a b button you are going to move over towards the marker you are going to quantum drive and then arrive at the location what you want to do once you are close to your location as you can see i am in navigation mode you just want to hold b go into your weapon mode or the non-navigation mode and get closer towards the salvage claim i would suggest being about 40 to 50 meters from the salvage to make sure it has the most efficiency especially with the vulture with the replicator it is i think it's the replicator it is going to be a lot further away due to the reclaimer there we go the reclaimer due to it is a very much bigger ship so what you want to do is you just want to come around the ship make sure you get the ship from above get closer to the ship like i said about 40 to 50 meters as you can see this is a little old uh, 100i as you can see here i'm 53 meters away from the ship so what you want to do next is you want to press l to turn on the lights you want to press m to bring out your weapons or your your your, your tractor beams your scraper modules and then what you can do is either you can use the ship to go up and down or you can press g to make the ship stand still and you are only going to use the lasers so after you have done that you are going to interact with the left mouse button to enter the engage tool once the ship is completely done you just want to fly around to make sure everything is red highlighted that you did not miss any salvaging and as you can see everything is showing red now now for the next step is to munch the ship so what you want to do is you want to press left alt and w to turn over to fraction mode and once you are on fraction mode you will see the ship highlights green and you want to just keep it still in the center and press your left mouse button it's going to fracture the ship it's going to take a while it's a little bit of a progress once this is done you will see the ship is going to explode into pieces once it has exploded into pieces you are gonna click the right mouse button and you are gonna switch over to this interrogate and then you want to just press the left mouse button again and you are gonna collect all the pieces also you will see here on the right hand side it is going to show you exactly how much ECU it is going to give you and the time it is going to take for the disintegration to complete and there everything is complete and what you want to do if you want to as well like if you have a big ship that 
pulls out the entire space of 13 ACU. What you want to do is you want to press M, exit your ship. Head over towards the back of the vulture, down the stairs, down the ladder. And you will see here, here you can eject all of the boxes into one ACU boxes. So once that is complete, what you want to do is you want to take out your multi-tool. If you forgot your multi-tool or you don't have one, you can always craft one in the vulture. So you want to take the box and you just like neatly want to do a little bit of lego building like i said if you do not have a multi-tool you can just click here on crafter craft the multi-tool as well as a tractor beam and then you are sorted you will see here just quickly going to eject this one and if you press m again you will see you have your space back in your ship so in total you can have up to 26 acu but once everything is done you want to go to the nearest tdd or in that case it is going to be hurston so it will be the cbd so once you arrive at a CBD on Hurston or at the TDD on any other spaceport, you will see you are only able to sell the recycled material RCM here and the construction material you aren't able to sell. And the reason for that is you can only sell them at the admin terminals. Once you arrived at the admit offices, you are going to interact with it and you will see here once you have chosen the Drake Vulture, you will be able to sell your construction materials here. This is not much because I did not do a very big ship due to for the video i don't want it to be too long but there you go guys this is where you are going to sell the materials the rmc is going to be at spaceports on area 18 origin uh, or orison uh new babbage is gonna be tdds and on laurel it is going to be the cbd and then the construction materials you want to sell on the admin's offices or by the admin's offices and if you struggle to find the admin offices on the ports the space station's admin offices is super easy to find so all you want to do when you want to sell at the, the admin offices on the space ports is you want to go to the galleria you are going to run down the stairs and 90 percent of the time the admin offices will be on your left hand side i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you do like the content please consider dropping a like and a subscribe on the video i would really appreciate it and as always remember take care of yourself drink enough water and stay thirsty peace